What's up roofing contractors? This is Michael Mignona. And in this video, I wanna share with you a really interesting way to get people to uh, move forward with you after you've given them a, a proposal, but they haven't really been answering your calls and texts and you wanna follow up with something that is gonna get them over the finish line. This, uh, you know, th this video is, is um, because I got an email from a client that was asking if I knew any strategies for that. And this is actually something that another one of my clients does to get uh, his potential clients, um, his homeowner clients to get over that finish line and actually get him to do the job. And it's awesome. So let me just share this with you. It's really simple. I actually typed it up. So I'm going to be reading what I think is a really cool text message to send to a homeowner that you've been wanting to close a deal with, but they just haven't really been that responsive. So let me read you what it says, and then we'll talk about it a little bit. So you can send in this text, you can send, hey, first name. So hey, Joe, or hey, Jim, or hey, Nancy, or whatever the name is. Hey, first name, this is, you know, so-and-so from blah, 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 roofing company. We had a cancellation for next Thursday or next Tuesday or whatever day you want to get them scheduled. And I'm looking to keep our guys busy that day. Would you be opposed to us doing your roof that day for a $1,000 discount? Let me know ASAP because otherwise I want to reach out to a couple of other homeowners we've spoken to recently. I hope you have a great day. So, I mean, think about that for a minute. You are giving them a discount, but it's not a discount for no reason, which seems like, you know, maybe you could have just charged $1,000 less from the get-go and, you know, now they're pissed that you were overcharging them a thousand because you don't mind doing the job for a thousand dollars less. This it's a good excuse as to why you want to give them that discount and really, uh, <clears throat> you know, give give that money off and get that job scheduled because you would have had a job that day. You're 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 paying your guys to to you're, you want to keep them busy. It's better to do a job for a thousand dollars less than you would normally do it, just to keep your guys busy and and to keep that. Um, that day scheduled with a job. So it's, it's totally justified and it makes them an offer that they feel is something that you could easily just take away, um, or give to someone else. So super powerful, um, a really good strategy for getting people over the finish line with you. And, um, that is that strategy. You can send it as a text message. You can call them on the phone and, and propose that and give them that offer. And it's super powerful. What I'm going to do just to make it easy for you to send a text message if you want is, or, or even just to read it, you know, when you're on the phone with them is I'm going to have a Google document that you can click on. Um, and then when you open it, you'll be able to just copy and paste it or make a copy of the document itself by going to file, make a copy. Um, and then you can edit it however you want. All right. So this is the Google doc I was talking about in the video that you're watching. Um, so below what you're watching or somewhere around it, you'll see a link to this, to this document. What you'll do is you'll click that link. And then when you get to this document, you go to file and then make a copy. And then that's gonna allow you to give it a new name. You might wanna call it, you know, cancellation offer. Uh, and then maybe you put the name of your company in. So, you know, Joe's Rubes or whatever, whatever the name of your company is, and then click okay. And now you've got your own copy that you can now edit. Now what you wanna do is you want to edit this with, I wouldn't change where it says first name, but I would change where it says your name, that's it's your name. So if your name is Joe, this is Joe from, and then Joe's Roofs, you'll obviously put your name and then the name of your roofing company. We had a cancellation for, and then the day you want to do job. So we had a cancellation for this Friday. Maybe this is something you're sending on a Monday and you want to like fill a job for Friday or you've got an opening on Friday or whatever. You want to make them an offer. We've got a, we've had a cancellation for this Friday or next Monday or next Thursday or two Tuesdays from now. And I'm looking to keep our guys busy that day. Would you be opposed to us doing your roof that day for, and then whatever the discount is. So I would do, I would personally, I would do at least a thousand bucks. You could do 500. I wouldn't go any lower than that. Otherwise it just seems like no biggie. I mean, a thousand bucks, that's compelling. Um, so you might say, you know, a thousand dollar discount. Let me know ASAP because otherwise I want to reach out to a couple of other homeowners we've spoken to recently. I hope you're having a great day. Done. So then what you do here, now you have this. You can copy and paste this into like the notes in your 
on your computer or on your phone so you can just copy and paste it and then just put their name in and then the day you want you want you know you had a cancellation for and then just text message that to them or just have this in front of you when you call the person and um and you know read it and just be like hey joe this is blah 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 from joe's ruse we had a cancellation for next Wednesday and I'm looking to keep our guys busy that day. Would you be opposed to us doing your roof that day for a $1,000 discount? Let me know ASAP because otherwise I want to reach out to a couple other homeowners we've spoken to recently. I hope you're having a great day. I mean, that's a really powerful thing. You know, that's a really cool offer. Like I said in, in, in this video, um, you know, this is, there's a good excuse for the discount because you want to keep that day busy. One, one thing I forgot to mention when I was introducing what this video was all about was the fact that it's important that you're saying, would you be opposed to us doing your roof that day for a $1,000 discount? People like saying no more than they like saying yes. So would you be opposed to that? No, I wouldn't be opposed to that. You're going to get, it's easier for them to say, no, I wouldn't be opposed than it is for them to say, like yes to a to a yes or no question. So, uh, if you said to them, um, "Would you like me to do your roof that day for a one thousand dollar discount?" They're not going to say yes as readily as if you phrased it, "Would you be opposed to us doing your roof that day?" Because it almost sounds like you're there now. You're allowing them a compromise, which is which is a powerful thing, um, and it's it's a really cool closing technique. All right, so that's it. That's this video. A little all over the place. I kind of filmed it in two different areas, and then decided to do the Google Doc demonstration on the video just so there were no questions. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoy these videos that I'm making. What I'm really going to be doing is sharing helpful sales and marketing techniques. Whenever I come across them, whether it's ideas that I have originally or ideas that my clients share with me that are helping them uh, be very successful, I talk to a lot of a lot of roofers all the time, and I get to hear the from the best of the best and what's working right now. And I'm going to share that with you. So that's it. Subscribe, like, comment, share, ring the bell, do everything, and I'll see you.